In today's tech tip, I'm going to answer the question, how do I transfer ownership of a Microsoft form? When you go to Microsoft Forms, you will see the new form button in the top left corner of the screen. Most people I know go, great, let's click that button and get started. What many people don't realize is the default is a personal form. While that's not a bad thing per se, it does mean that by default, you are the only owner of the form and the only one who can manage it. And a word of warning here about that, personal forms are tied to your OneDrive. When you leave the company, they usually delete your OneDrive, which means the form is deleted too. As a suggested best practice, don't build forms for key business processes as personal forms. Notice that the new survey I just created and the customer satisfaction survey have my name underneath them. That's how you know it's a personal form. If it's a group form, you will see the name of the group underneath the form. If you realize that you really need this form to belong to a group, the good news is you don't have to start over. It's possible to transfer ownership of a personal form to a group. There's a link to a Microsoft article in the description so that you can learn more. Let's take a look at an example. I will click on all my forms. Then I will click on the three dots for more options. And here you will see an option for move to group. We're going to select that and you will see a panel open up on the right hand side of the screen. Choose the appropriate group, in this case M365 webinars, and then click move. If we go back to the home screen, we can go to the M365 webinar group and you will see that the form is now owned by that group and everyone who belongs to it can see the form, edit it, and check the results. As I mentioned earlier, when you click on the three dots, you will see that there is no option to move the form again. If you really need to change groups, the best option is to share it as a template. If you want me to do a tech tip on that process, drop a comment below and let me know. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video.